Hi, Mary from Reviewer's Diary. I have two things for you tonight. One is going to be a thing that you vote on, and the other one is a pinch me unboxing. So I'm going to put off the voting items until after I do this unboxing. Now, I did get on pinch me a little bit late. So I didn't get a whole lot of stuff. I missed the announcement. You have to try to um, keep an eye on your email and it comes in the middle of the day and I missed, I missed it just because I never can remember to do that. You can do it on your phone so if you do carry your cell phone with you, which I normally do, you can actually go on and make your choices at that time. So I only got a couple things but I got a couple of really neat things. So here's the box and there was this scotch Brite dishcloth. It has a scrubby side to it. I don't normally use dishcloths, but uh, this might be good. Wow, this is awfully scrubby though. I mean, it's so scrubby that I don't know if I can use it um, cleaning anything else. Hmm. Maybe I'll try cleaning my shower doors with this. Yeah, that's, that's an idea. We use a regular Scotch-Brite sponge, um, and it is Scotch-Brite that's down in my kitchen right now. So yeah, this is pretty, but it's definitely um, a tough one. So I think that I'll try to use it in the shower. <clears throat> Next thing is a snack, and this is actually gonna go really great with the chicken salad sandwich I just picked up at Wawa. Just in case you don't live in this area, or in Pennsylvania or New Jersey. Wawa's like a, you know, a 7-Eleven, only better. They have everything. Um, so this I'm going to actually really enjoy. These are popcorners and they're crispy, crunchy popped corn chips. So I have to think they're less fattening. Um, but yeah, it's pretty cool. So that'll be, you do have to like go on to the Pinch Me site and review stuff that you get, but you can review it just on the site. You don't have to spread it all over the place. And there's one more thing in here, and I got this actually because my dog is on medication. So this is just a sample pack um, and a dollar off coupon for pill pockets. So it's probably only got a couple in there. Yeah, so, yeah, pretty cool. Um, if he likes them, it'll be a lot easier to give him his medicine. So these are the three things that I got in this pinch me box. And I only got three things because it's all about timing. Um, I've learned that it's all about timing. So I got the pop, pop corners, um, pill pockets, and this scrubby thing. Not bad. Yeah, I mean, it's free stuff. You can't lose. Um, down below, there is linked Pinch Me. Sometimes when you first start, you only get like one or two things, but when you start to sign on more often, there are more things that open up to you. And also, I've never been really good at watching the deadline, so I'm never gonna be one of those YouTubers who has a big giant, well, who knows, big giant Pinch Me box. That's probably never gonna happen for me. Um, a lot of times the people that you see on YouTube who have big pinch me boxes, those are sent to them for review. So they'll pack it full of like everything that everybody could pick so that they can show it on their channel and um, at least that's what quite a few of them have said. So they can show it on their channel and show people what they can possibly get. Now to the voting thing like to make things interesting. You know I've been in search of the perfect face care, skin care. Um, I'm older, I am getting fine lines, I do use Retin-A at night so I have to be careful what I use. Um, I can't use a cleanser that's like glycolic acid filled at night. And what I want to do is I want to use one skin regimen for 10 days and the other skin regimen for 10 days and see how they compare. 
I will say that they both have a pre-cleanse oil and what I've been doing though on my own is I've been using the sweet almond oil I hope you can see the brand name it looks kind of like it's in focus from here but I've been using this like for years I have two bottles of this you could see that this one is in a challenge and I'm already down to there I just put a dime size amount in the palm of my hand and then I tap into it and I then I rub it all over my face and it takes off all makeup so at night it's great because it functions as taking off your makeup in the morning I also use it because I wake up and I've got all this face cream like a lot of people say oh all you have to do is splash your face in the morning not if you put a lot of stuff on your face you really need to get that off so then I go back in with this um, but this time in the morning I massage my face I start by going here I watched it on I think it was a video on YouTube but you start here and then I work around my eyes um, and then I work here and then I rub my chin and here what my plan is to do is by the end of the month it's gonna be quite a few videos from now so I'm thinking it'll probably won't be until maybe like the 30th of October hope you guys can wait but I am gonna do a nighttime skincare routine so I don't use Retin-A every night I know I should but I don't um, so there'll be a little bit of other stuff mixed in because I'll do a nighttime morning slash morning because my morning routine is not going to be that different from my nighttime routine except for the Retin-A. So I have two different brands here. I have this and I have this. Now I want to do a 10 day with each one of these. What you're going to do is you're going to vote for which one you want to see me do first. So I'll take everything out of the packages and I'll show you. I had to wait until I got the pre-cleanse oil. I did buy this bottle of pre-cleanse oil because um, there was pre-cleanse oil on the swap sites, but nobody seemed to want to part with it. It's not the most expensive item in the Dermalogica line, but um, nobody wanted to part with theirs. So why list it if you're not going to part with it? But that's neither here nor there. I ended up buying this. This was eight dollars and something, eight dollars and change. Um, I bought it on Amazon. Uh, it is does have like a seal on it that tells me that it is a legitimate product, um, and um, it is sold. Let's see, there it is, and it's coded by Amazon also. So uh, you know what? <laughs> I just uh, anyway. <laughs> This pre-cleanse oil, you see, I like to take my makeup off first. So when I do my nighttime skincare routine, you'll see me do that. So I still take my eye makeup off and I try to wipe as much makeup off as I can because I don't want my skincare products to just be like mixing with what makeup is left. I'm not using them as a makeup remover. I'm using them more as like um, something that's good for my skin. To each their own. A lot of people use this as their makeup remover. I, I don't know. I'm kind of against that, but that's just me. So this I did get um, on a trade on the swap site. I swapped a couple of non-cruelty free items, and I somebody enclosed a little um, soap bar in there, and it has the um, special cleansing gel. And it has this toner that you spritz on. So it's like a toner spray. And it does have the um, moist, I'll hold it up so you can see it, skin uh, lotion. It's not my intent to change the moisturizers that I use. I have moisturizers that I really do like, but, and I, even the ones that I'm not that wild about, I want to use those up first, but, um, 
you know, it, I did get the cream with this, so I would use this. So it's going to be either the Dermalogica for 10 days or the other option is Erno Laszlo. They're both pretty expensive brands. I think this one might be more expensive, but I'm not sure. They're pretty close. So this is a travel size set and it has the pre-cleanse oil, a bar of soap. I have the little tiny one. These things last forever. So, um, and this is the toner. Oops. And there goes the soap. <laughs> Thank God it wasn't anything else. Um, so it came with all three parts and this is, um, pretty nice set. When I was a teenager, my mom had purchased, um, Erno Laszlo for both of us and I really loved it. So I was interested in trying this again. So anyway, my mom had purchased this for both of us, um, when I was young and I don't know what happened. We probably went on to something else when it was all done but I remember really enjoying it. I don't know that it's still the same. It might not be, but you know, it does have the pre-cleanse, the soap and the toner, which is a moisturizing toner. So that's it. I want you guys to vote. Um, and there'll be a poll up above, but I have to give a deadline. So the deadline for voting for this will be, let's see, today is, um, I'm recording this on Tuesday. You might not see it until Thursday because I have a couple unboxings and I think they need to take precedence. But um, I will make the deadline Friday night at midnight and that way I can check Saturday morning and see what you guys voted. So thank you for watching and um, don't forget to vote. I'm really interested to find out just what exactly you guys would like me to um, start using first because honestly for me it's up in the air the only thing I won't be doing is I won't be using cleansers that are in my use up but I think that'll be okay for 20 days because <laughs> I've actually used quite a bit of that up already so thank you and um, don't forget to vote I really want to know what you think and if you want to comment below please do. I try to answer all the comments. And if you're not subscribed yet, please do subscribe. Thanks and have a beautiful evening. Good night.